everyone! Welcome back to Reading with Leanne, and we are going to read the book The Watermelon Seed by Greg Pizzoli. Okay, so looking at this book, it looks like it's going. Can you guess what it's about? Maybe about a crocodile eating a watermelon? I love watermelon! <laughs> it's the best! It's so good that he puts a medal first place on his watermelon. Ever since I was a teeny tiny baby crocodile, it's been my favorite. Look at him in the baby carriage. <laughs> the watermelon peels are all around the ground. I like it for breakfast, I like it for lunch, I like a big salty slap for dinner, and I love it for dessert. Is that watermelon ice cream? I love watermelon. Go. I just swallowed a seed. I swallowed a seed! It's growing in my guts! So, this is an x-ray. We could see through the crocodile's body. And there's a big watermelon in the gut. Soon vines will come out of my ears. Can you imagine the seed growing, 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 and the plat coming out of your ears? My stomach will stretch. My skin will turn pink. Oh man, I don't want to be in fruit salad. Fruit salad, kiwi, strawberry, crocodile. He curls up. Somebody please help me. Oh, no. Grumble. Grumble. You, sometimes you hear noise in your tummy, right? Oh no. I feel it growing inside me. It's happening now. My stomach feels funny. <laughs> What came out of the crocodile? He burped and the seed came out. Oh, here's the seed. That was too close. No more melon for me. Never again. But the crocodile has been eating watermelon since he was a baby. Can he really give it up? Can he really stop eating watermelon? Hmm. Well, maybe just a teeny tiny bite. <coughs> chomp, chomp, chomp. Oh no! Do you think he swallowed more seeds? Look at all those watermelon peels next to him. And that is the end of our book. Thanks so much for reading The Watermelon Seed with me.